what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so this will be a rather quick video to give an update or just talk about a supposed update that's looking to be on the horizon for happy death day to us aka happy death day 3 christopher landon responded to a fan on twitter uh when they brought up the fact that they were missing him and it's been a while since they had harassed him i guess about happy death day 3 and he responded with i might have some news on the distant horizon for you which has got myself and many others those of you looking at this video who are fans of the happy death day films happy death day and happy death day to you we might have a third film that we all have been waiting to see since the second film released uh near i guess a little over two years ago at this point so we know that those films revolved around jessica ross character tree where she's stuck in like this groundhog day situation where she keeps being killed by this baby face mask killer and she's a little bit of a uh i i will say she's a little bit of a airhead at the start of the film but she grows into her character and we learn that there's a, a we get to know her and start to start to feel sympathy for this character and get to see that there's layers to her and that she has her reasons for why she is the way that she is but she learns to not let her past contribute to her being nasty to everybody and i, I like that growth of that character in that first film the first film is very much more a horror comedy in terms of like it's more horror based in my opinion it's very lighthearted at times of course we have those montages that we get in both films with the music montages of the death sequences but happy death day to you is very much more in the lines of comedy in my opinion with the whole sci-fi uh the sci-fi route that they took basically being spearheaded over horror at that point in that in that one so hopefully with happy death day to us they go back to its roots and kind of give us more of a just straight horror type vibe in this one with shades of the comedy that they do very well in these movies christopher landon we know he wrote the first and the second film blumhouse jason blum he has specified his interest in this film many times in the past and christopher landon himself he has wrote an idea for the third movie some time ago and they're all pretty excited for it again this is a quote that i'm reading and he says it's different than the other two films so they're just crossing their fingers and hoping that the fan base continues to grow and that'll of course ignite what many of us are expecting is now going to happen with these recent words he had for us on twitter saying they might have something for us on the horizon soon so hopefully whatever we find out has to do with production starting has to do with the film actually being greenlit officially and happy death day to us will be with us at some point in the near future now of course jessica roth needs to come back as tree i love her in that role the character of tree i think honestly i i just appreciate how when the movie really started the first happy death day i'm like is this really the person we're going to follow this entire time because they're not very likable as a character jessica roth was killing it as this mean girl but she she's not likable and then there's layers to this mean girl and that's like i'm like okay there we go now it makes sense now she's becoming likable now we're getting to feel sorry for this girl we're getting to understand and recognize that hey the way you're behaving is wrong but we see where you're coming from we're not justifying your mean behavior but the fact that you are able to now recognize the source of pain that you clearly have and you're going to now act better and treat people better and not let your pain get you in such a rut that you act like a horrible person that's when tree showed signs of hope and that's when tree became a likable character in the original film so now that character has a special place in my heart i always like when you have characters who have these mean sides to them but of course it's always stemming from something very tragic that they just went through in this case with tree she had just lost her mother so i can definitely understand and relate to that sort of so i like that character i hope jessica roth comes back to play this role if happy death day to us is what's going to happen with this announcement or something that we have on the horizon to expect from christopher landon if he ends up announcing this news uh because the keyword there is might have some news on the distant horizon for us because he may in fact not bring up anything because something might not fall through the way that he was hoping it would but the fact that he's teasing us means to me that there's mostly more pros than cons that could be dished out regarding a potential happy death day three aka happy death day to us since that's the title they apparently want to go with so i know a lot of us were calling it happy death day tree which i think is clever but i hope the movie happens i hope the movie comes out if not of course next year 2023 at the latest just off needs to be back 
a lot of the other characters that were factored into those two films need to be back the character of danielle i think that's where the second film ended off with her in like some type of facility so i hope they i really don't know if they'll even bother addressing that i feel like that was a little bit com too comical at the end of the second film but again both films are still very well made good good films to watch and enjoy let me know what you guys think about all this down in the comment section below are you looking forward to this do you think this could mean happy death day 3 is on the horizon what do you think from christopher landon's tweet what are your thoughts on the other two films if you haven't already make sure you subscribe turn on post notification and miss a video in the description i have links to my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video